everyone welcome to another frabalistic vlog starting out today with a bit of exercise i've got my skateboard sister's got her running gear on which consists of a hat what are you doing on my skateboard don't hurt yourself anyways let's go i want to see if the broken tree like one of them they hadn't cleared up that day so i hope it's there so we can go take a look at it if not let's go do a bit of exercising and stuff like that i'm just a skater girl she said see you later <laughs> Oh boy. Anyways, I couldn't really be bothered to run today because I just took a shower and didn't want to get all sweaty. But look at this, a bit of car spotting in the area. Matte black as well. That's matte black, right? Hey, hey, look at that beast. It's a hard not life for us. It's a hard not life for us. Na, na, na. <laughs> you know what's extremely funny? Whoa. My sister takes running so seriously, like she, she she puts her eyebrows together and looks all mad and stuff. Hey, what's up guys? <laughs> Always good to see the yo-yo squad in the area. This is what is left of the palm tree we saw yesterday. Well, that is the remainder. It used to be one huge tree. Now the poor guy's gone. <laughs> Don't give up guys. Don't give up. Always keep going. Oh wait, no, 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 I've got an idea, I've got an idea. Play a spear with it, like. My sister actually used to do javelin in her GCSEs. <laughs> this is what you call javelin with a stick. That was a pathetic throw. <laughs> Let me show you guys how you properly javelin. You have to have the swing in the arm, okay? So yours went somewhere around there. Okay. I'm oh, you won! Oh. It is so hot right now. I don't even know why I came for a skateboard ride. I took a shower and I'm already sweating, but I really love the view you get over here at the mornings. This is motivation mode, motivation Mondays. <laughs> I don't even know what day it is to be honest. I, I think it's Sunday today. Anyways, let's continue my skateboarding session. Now that I'm home, I actually want to show you guys something. It's a little update with my YouTube channel. And there's a reason I want to show you this. So the other day I was on Twitter and I don't use Twitter that often. I'm not going to lie. I'm just not a Twitter person. But I was on there and somebody tweeted, Mo Vlogs isn't even verified, that means he has fake subscribers. And I was confused, I was probably confused, I was like, really? So, I went to do one email, and now I'm officially verified for you haters that think, guys, I don't know why people still don't think, like, my YouTube is legit, like, just a heads up, YouTube would not send you the 100k plaque if your subscribers were fake. But just for you guys who want to see my YouTube channel is verified, I'm going to quickly log in and show you. BAM guys, you see that? Verified. So I finally have a tick next to my name. So yeah, I think I actually need to say a big thank you to the person who tweeted that. Because if it wasn't for his tweet, I actually wouldn't have even cared to go get that verification tick. Because I'm not really somebody who cares about having like an official page or stuff like that. I make the videos for you guys to watch, but... Now I can actually say, yo, you know, you know I'm a verified YouTuber, right? I, I'm verified. <laughs> look, look, I'm verified on YouTube. I've got a tick next to my name. Oh, yeah. Where is the That's tick? what's up. Look, next to my vlogs. Scroll the mouse. Scroll what? the mouse. Oh, yeah. You verified YouTuber. The haters got it for me. No, no, you ain't verified, bro. Chill, chill, chill. <laughs> you ain't verified, bro. You ain't verified. How do you get verified? How do you do it? You need to have the contacts. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Basically, all the fakes will get exposed, okay? How do you know which one's verified? It has a tick. That's how you know if you have a tick. So click on it, and there, it has a tick next to the. I don't know. I don't know. Just leave it alone. I don't know, guys, okay? I don't know what it does, but I finally have it, okay? I have a verification okay, tape. such a big person on YouTube, okay? I'm gonna head out soon, but before I do, I was gonna do something, you know? I just can't remember it. 
What was I gonna do? Okay, I quickly remembered what I was gonna do. Basically, I've had these like five letters sitting on the table and we haven't opened them. So, me and Mommy Mo are quickly, very quickly gonna go through them. I'm gonna read all of the letters off the vlog, but I'll show you everything inside them at the end, okay? So let's get cracking, guys. Mommy Mo, let's do the honors. First letter was from Brooke. Came with a load of coins. <laughs> And yeah, thank you, my man. I don't even know where these are from, but they look super awesome. Oh, second letter is from Shanker. He sent me this really awesome note and this little keychain from Lana, which I'll give her in a moment, okay? So, oh, shh. <gasps> no, is that what I just saw? <laughs> is that what I just saw? This is $100 gold plated. No. Oh my god. What? Guys, this is a $100 gold plated note. Wow. Oh my god. Huge shout out to Lucas. He is the one who sent that $100, as well as these mint condition notes, which are from, this says Banco Central and Republic of Brazil. Wow, I'm still in shock from this 100, a uh, gold plated $100 note, because this looks insane. What, 24 karat plated. So next up, Nixie has sent us a 2,000 Costa Rica money. So thank you for that. It's actually sellotaped for this letter, so I'm not going to pull it off in case I rip it. But really do appreciate that. Wow, Mummy Mo has literally just been opening them, handing them to me. It's like a joint effort. What? This mail time is insane, guys. Okay. <laughs> Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, everybody. Let me quickly show you this note in depth because this is one of the coolest notes I've seen. I think I've got a similar note before, but look, it's invisible. <gasps> Do you guys see my eyes through there? That is really, really awesome stuff. Look, you see my hand passing through it. And as I said, like, until like two weeks ago, I never knew like Canada had the queen on its note. But that's really awesome. Thank you to thank you to thank you to Ethan for sending that buy from Canada, I think. Thank you to Simon from Sweden for sending this Cronor buy. Appreciate it. And the final letter to end off. What? I've actually never even seen these notes. Mommy, do you know what this is? Thank you to the Danish Moro for this Danish Cronor. But guys, take a look at the note. I've never seen a note so simple like this. Look, it's really, really simple. Look at that. Awesome, awesome stuff. Anyways, guys, short little mail time with my mom. Thank you to all of you for sending stuff by. Oh yeah, quickly before I go, because I need to be at the mall, my friends. Let's go give this to Lana, because this is actually a really, really cool chain. Look at that, guys. It says Lana Rose. And it's got a flower on it, which is really cool. So I'm gonna give this to her, head out with my friends, and go. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Lana? Yes, Tom. What are you doing, by the way? My makeup. Yo Squad gave you this, which is a really cool keychain with your name on it. Oh. <gasps> that is and it's got a rose. <laughs> That's a fairy. It's a fairy? I thought yeah, it was a rose. It's a that's so cool. Oh, okay. So Anyways, nice. there you go, guys. Thank Enjoy you. that. Wow, Put it on your cool. keys Thank and you. sorry, see you soon. Right okay, you. complete your makeuping, whatever you're doing. Bye. Okay, I just got to the mall, but there's always something nice about looking at two Rolls Royces next to each other. Super, super elegant. We just came into the gaming section, guys, and I see a free pair of tickets on a game. This, this, this is what you call. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you call collecting points. I'm gonna go around and see how many I can get. So except from these, I couldn't find any more tickets in the game section, but I thought this game looked really cool. Look at that. 
They've actually got Batman seats over here, but you know, we've been in the real Batmobile, so I'm not too impressed. So my boy brought me over to this ice cream place and they're actually gonna chuck the ice cream and I'm gonna catch it. So there's a lot on the line over here. So yeah, good luck to me. Okay guys, I'm gonna be catching an ice cream. Let's see. So you guys saw my attempt at catching it. Now the professionals are gonna do it. I like chested the ice cream down. Okay, let's see them do it. All right. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> That's what you call a catch. Thank you. Anyways, there you go guys. I'm having my first ice cream which I caught myself. I caught it like a football player. I chested it down into the cup. <laughs> I just finished up over here with my friend. We just came here to eat, literally. But we're heading out again to go meet up with Lyndon. You guys, I think, should know him by now. But look at this Hurrican. That is one of the coolest Hurricanes I've ever seen. Uh, we were actually going to do this to our car. You see the eyelids on the car? Well, I call them eyelids, but they're not, obviously. But then we kind of were like, eh, eh, and we didn't do it. But I think it still looks really, really gorgeous. Okay, so we're just on our way to the Karak house where we're going to right now. But the view is absolutely ridiculous right now, what you get. So, check that out, guys. The Burj Khalifa. The top half is covered by clouds, which just looks really, really cool. Yo, you know the moon is straight above it? I swear, that looks awesome. I'm not sure if you saw that, guys. You know, I feel like, um, you know, like, when you go to, like, Hollywood? What's that? You know when you go to Hollywood and you're, like, sticking your head? Oh, yeah, 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 you're sticking your head outside the window. Wait, let's see if we can see it, guys. <laughs> I know, my camera drops. I'm doomed, guys. Look at that, guys. The moon is right there, Burj Khalifa over there. Anyways, I really love coming by the downtown area because look at all the palm trees they have and they're all lit up over here, which makes it look really cool. So we just made it over to this Karak place, it's called Karak House, it has some tea and met up with my boy Lyndon, we got Puriya here, Essa and you know your boy Warren over here. We just had our tea guys, it's actually really nice over here, check it out. But obviously you guys know the awesome view here, like that's my favourite, I'm trying to time lapse that. <gasps> it's changing colours now. Okay guys, let's just enjoy the view right now because that looks epic. Yo, look at the look at the bridge. That yeah, looks amazing. I, yeah, look, look, look at the clouds covering at the top. Yeah, no, that is sick right there. And if my mind work backwards just for a minute, mm, I hold on to you before the memories go. I remember you. Check out the top of Burj Khalifa. You can't even see it right now because the clouds are that into it. By the way, I completely forgot to mention, guys. Since Lyndon is here, he is now finally recovered. So I'm alive, guys. Thank I, God. I saw that here, like, I'm finally alive. But yeah, there you go. Thankfully, he did get better. But yeah, there you go. Lyndon in action again with his vlog camera. Let go. Pump out the vlogs, Lyndon. Pump out the <laughs> vlogs. Okay, I think we're heading out now. Good day seeing you guys. And yeah, peace out. All right, boys. The ride is here. Maybach pulled up and we're about to leave. Look, we come loaded with guns out here. <laughs> He's always loaded guys, He's always loaded. We got the paintball gun inside. <laughs> what was that? Turned it off, is it? Oh, that's how it turns off. Uh. You can smell the, what is it, nitrogen? What, what power is this? Gas. Oh. See guys, don't mess with us, we will shoot you. There's actually something in the Maybach which I haven't showed you till now because I showed you pretty much everything except the TV. And the cool part about the TV is, look, when you turn it on, I love the fact that the Maybach logo comes up. But 
you guys already know I'm in love with the interior of this car it's just amazing and it's so so relaxing like just sleeping in the back seat like I know why people get this car it's like if you're ex like an extremely busy person and the only relaxing you get is in your car then this car is perfect because it gets you to place to place like and you can sleep in between but yeah then we're gonna go to the Mustang the Mustang is a luxury car right <laughs> nothing like turning on my Mustang Oh yeah. Shawty, I don't mind when you work in the three. If you're leaving with me, go make that money, 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 your money, money, money. Yo, guess what? My mom and sister found. They found my glasses. Yes. Okay. Basically, guess where it was, guys. In the tissue box of the Lamborghini. I think I must have been at an event, chucked it like down and it just fell into the tissue box. But your glasses, hey, hey, they're still with me, guys. And look, this was the little scratch I was talking to you about somewhere here. On, like, I can't, I don't think you guys can see it, but there's a tiny scratch on it. So, yeah, if you guys are searching for my glasses, don't worry, I found them. <laughs> I can't imagine somebody actually searching around for my glasses, but woohoo, we found it. I literally just got in, like I just made it home. I was having the time of my life getting driven around in a Maybach. Now back to my regular duties. My mom's like, I need somebody to drive me to the grocery store. Darn it! Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Why? Why? I was, I, should, I was having such a good time today, mommy. Sitting back, back seat of a Maybach, getting driven around, and now I'm my mom's personal chauffeur again. You need to Don't lie. So I'm not sure if this was just my primary school, but sometimes, once in a while, we would take, like, you know, these pastas, and we would color them and give them out like one at a time. I can't remember exactly what it was for. It was super random, but basically we'd take pasta, like color it in with like a highlighter, like make a little design on it and then give it out. But I, I just, I don't know why we did it. Now that I think about it, it doesn't make sense because you can't eat it because you colored it and there's literally nothing you can do with it. So. There you go, the dumb stuff we do when we're kids. I don't, why would the schools even set that as a project to us? Oh, go take a pasta and color it in. All right guys, I thought I'd show you something. Every time I come home, my cat, Kitty, she loves to steal my shoes. Let me show you guys. You see, she has a tendency of taking my shoes and like lying down across them in this position. Or sometimes she kind of puts her head yeah, on. Her so face she face uses it like sort of like a pillow or like a rest Why arm is her rest. Head inside it though. That's what I'm wondering. She loves shoes, by the way. She Can loves. I take off her? No, no, don't, don't. She's relaxing. <laughs> you know, she's in love with shoes. Give her any shoe, she'll be so happy. She's getting really comfy now. What are you doing? What is she doing? <laughs> By the way, I thought I'd show you guys our updated fridge with some more magnets that you guys sent us by. I'm not sure if you guys remember these, but look, we've got all of these. Wait, where were these from, by the way? Do you remember, Lana? These zoo ones. Bali. Bali, yeah, there we go, guys. The Bali magnets. So that is our fridge so far. Imagine, Lana, one day this whole thing yeah. with magnets. <laughs> That would be awesome. But at the moment, it's coming along really nicely thanks to you guys. Mo Vlogs, Lana Rose. Keep calm because I love you, mom. <laughs> oh, that's our mommy Mo and all of that stuff. So, yeah. As always, everybody, I'm going to wrap up today's vlog here. I love you all. Stay awesome. And don't forget, your boy is a legitimate YouTuber now. Anyways, stay awesome. Love you all. Yalla, yolo. Goodbye.